the matchup. Today we have a very special video for you guys because we have Matthew him here. Too. We are buying our first car, even though Matthew cannot drive, so it's not technically his car yet, but he's going to be paying for some of it as well as Tommy, so it's also his car too. But we've never had a car for the, like ourselves. So today is gonna be the lucky day where we're gonna get our first car. So I'll take you guys along with what that looks like. But before we get on to the video, guys, make sure if you still haven't yet hit that subscribe button, hit it down below, also hit that like button, and now let's get on to the video. Hello, guys. So today is the day where we're going to go look at the car we wanna buy. Uh, we found it, it's like a used car because we're not gonna buy a brand new car. First of all, I only have one more year until I'm in college and then I won't bring a car to college, so doesn't really make sense. So basically, right now we're gonna go look at the car, make sure like it's, it's in good condition, it's a car that we want, like drives well and whatever, so we're gonna go do that. Um, the car is like 30 minutes away, so it's a bit of a drive, but we're gonna go do that. I'm really excited to see what it looks like and drive it for the first time. I brought my license, so I had that so I can drive it and test it out and make sure it's all good. I'm going to test out the car and stuff because first of all, Tommy's in college so he can't come and then Matthew can't drive yet so I'm the one who gets to test it out because it's like the older kid's car so I'm really, really excited to see how it is and if it runs well and it's a cool car, I'm really excited. Isabel is coming along on this adventure. Yep. She wants, she'll probably get this car in the future when we're done with it, when we're all in college. Isabel always gets our hand-me-downs which yep. is so lucky. Like she gets our old like iPods and stuff before we, <laughs> even when we get got phones. So she has like four of our electronics yeah, that she just like, gets all of them. <laughs> She's kind of lucky. And then she'll get this car even though, you know, I don't know, will it still be in style when you're driving? Hopefully. Hopefully, it's a 2014, so probably. This is the car guys, it's a Subaru Outback. We really like it, we really like yeah. it, it's so nice. It's beautiful. That's our car. Yeah. This is, Hopefully our new car. So I was just lifting this up. I'm like, okay, that's so cool. And I go, and I realize there's two buttons. And Whoa. I press one. And it has trippy. I'm already in the driver's seat. Yeah, I'm ready. ready. I'm ready to drive. It's really nice. It's really nice. Do you like it? I love it. I mean, I can drive yeah, now. Yeah, I really, is it, no. I can't go on 15. No, 16, 16 bro. 16. You can't drive. You gotta know your. I can drive a golf cart. <laughs> I mean, you. you're not very good, but. Hey, I am very good. I'm better than Maggie driving golf. Not true. <laughs> Guys, it's looking good so far. I, it's looking like we'll be able to get it. So, we just looked at the car and it's looking really good. So, we're gonna buy it, but we can't get it today. We're getting it tomorrow. My dad's picking it up after work and then bringing it back to our house. So, I'll show you guys a tour of what it looks like on the inside, like when we get it tomorrow. What do you think? Do you like it? I love it. I love so it. So clean. It's <laughs> so, it looks like brand new. Yeah. Like, it's so nice. And yeah, I'm excited. Hello guys, so it is a couple days after and I've had my car for now about five or six days. So I'm gonna show you guys that what it looks like on the inside. Well, here's it on the outside. We'll give an outside tour. This is what my car looks like from the outside. Really nice. And it's a Subaru Outback. So I'm gonna give you guys like a tour of the inside. So right now I'm sitting in the front seat. We've got a very nice, actually I forgot the key so I can't really turn it on. See, it says access to key not detected. So this is the steering wheel, obviously. Did we see if the horn's loud? Oh, it's a nice horn. Right here is the best part about it because it has a backup camera. Backup cameras are one of the most important things in my opinion because seeing outside of that window, like you, you can see like basically like the back, but you can't really see if there's like a little toddler walking behind your car. I feel like it's really hard to see that because it's like a high up window. So the backup camera is what I'll be using probably the most and the thing I'm the most thankful for in this car because I don't know how people do it without backup cameras because I get so scared I'm going to hit a little kid who's just walking because it's just so hard to see because it's so high up. So that's what I use the backup camera for. I still look out my back window but I just make sure I check the camera too to make sure there's not like a little kid running behind my car which would scare me so much. Down here we have the gear changer and then we have 
cup holders and oh my goodness another one of my favorite aspects are the heated seats i live in wisconsin and if you've never been to wisconsin just know that it is freezing all the time so heated seats are a must in this car so i'm so thankful that we have heated seats in here and i already used it so many times and it's still september and it's my favorite thing and then down here we have a really cool like compartment where it opens to this but there's a secret compartment so you open two and then you have this little thing that's for my license plate but there's two different compartments here so if you wanted to put like Papers here would be good, and then if you wanted to put larger things, you could put it there. And then this is a passenger seat. I wanted to keep my car all clean, but right there, Matthew sat in it after soccer and already got mud in my car, which I'm a little salty about, but whatever. I'm just kidding. I'm not salty about it because Matthew also helped buy this car, so... Thank you, Matthew. I'm not salty about your car. You ruining my car or anything. I'm not salty. Right here, I do not know what these buttons do. There's like little house buttons. I have no idea what that do does. Another one of my favorite aspects of this car is the sunroof. I know I have so many different aspects of this car that I'm obsessed with, but sunroofs are so cool. Like it just like brings in a bunch of natural light. Like this is the light when it's closed. And this is the lighting when it's open. There's a difference. I see a difference. Maybe you guys don't. Comment down below if you see a difference. But I think it's really nice. I love sunroofs. It just kind of like opens a whole feel. And especially like if it's raining outside, it's so cool. You can just look at the sunroof. Um, also, another thing I like about this is that the seats like are just can adjust so much. These This front seat right here, which is really nice. I'm always in the front seat because I drive this car and so it's really cool. And then last but not least, we just have the back here. It's kind of just simple. Um, three seats in the back for if we ever have guests in the car or if I wanted to ever drive my siblings anywhere. It's nice we have five seats in this car. So I'm very, very happy this car. Shout out to Katie if you're watching this video. She is the one who owned the car before us um and she kept very great care of it so i really love this car and thank you so much for being willing to give it up to me it's a very nice car and i love it so much i've already driven to school every day quickly before this video ends i just want to explain why i bought this car because like i don't know i just want to explain this we already have two cars which we're very thankful for my mom drives one and then my dad drives the other so i got my license about three months ago i think and it's been harder for me to have a, a car available to me when I need it because my mom's always running errands, dropping people off and stuff. And then my dad's at work all day with his car. So I needed a car so I could like run carpools because I've, I've liked, I like to drive a lot. So I always run the carpools, help pick Matthew up from soccer, Isabella up from volleyball or whatever. I always drive people around. And so it's really nice that I have my own car. So if my mom's like at the grocery store or something, I can still use my car and drive to my friend's house or drive Matthew to his friend's house or soccer practice or whatever. Another thing is that we, all the kids, go to different schools. Well, Matthew and I go to the same school. Isabel goes to a different school and then Owen and Colin go to the same school, a different school. So we go to three different schools. So it's easy for me to have my own car so I can drive Matthew and I to school and so my dad doesn't have to worry about it and my mom can just drive Isabel, Owen, and Colin and it just makes life easier. Lastly, every day at my school, I volunteer to go to a nearby elementary school and help a bunch of third graders so this car is really nice especially if it's like thunderstorming and like i can walk if it's nice but if it's like ever thunder thunderstorming i would not want to like walk in it or like slip if it's like icy so it's nice that i have this car so i can always drive it over there if it's like raining or pouring or lightning or whatever and so i don't have to worry about like getting struck by lightning or anything like that so this car is just really handy for that i'm very excited for where this car will take me i know it's gonna do wonders in my life right now and i'm more than blessed also shout out to matthew and tommy because that's amazing did help pay for this car as well because they are awesome brothers i know tommy's in college so he can't you can drive this car right now and matthew doesn't even have his permit to drive so basically it's my car for now but it's all of our cars so they shout out to you boys for helping me with this car because it's it's been great and matthew's been getting rides with me every day so i think it's really helpful thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed watching our car buying process it was all kind of new it kind of came 
all like of a sudden it, this happened like really really quickly like i wanted i knew i wanted a car for a while but i never actually took the steps to get one and all of a sudden we found one and it just like came really fast and i'm so grateful for this opportunity because it's very helpful and it's been making everyone's lives easier just to have a car like this too make sure if you guys like this video you hit the big thumbs up also hit that subscribe button down below and if you want to check out some of our other videos they will be somewhere on the screen we will see you guys next week wednesday at 4 p.m central bye